past the evening sky. All the birds are leaving, but how can they know it's time for them to go? No thought of time. For who knows where the time goes? Who knows where the time goes? Got a special treat today. The song is Who Knows Where the Time Goes. And that beautiful video you just heard sung by my YouTube friend Holly, who's known as Alpet07 on YouTube. Her beautiful video inspired me to, to learn the song, which I used to know when I was young, and put up a lesson for everybody with it. So thanks a lot, Holly, for volunteering to help out with today's lesson. And I'm sure everybody's enjoying listening to Holly sing it instead of having to listen to me sing it like usual. So anyway, um, it's a beautiful, beautiful guitar arrangement that she has behind this video. Uh, it takes a few unusual chords, but it's very, very easy to play once you learn those chords. So uh, let's learn those chords together right now and uh, see how easy this is. It starts off on an E, standard E major. And then it moves to a chord I'm going to call F sharp sus. Basically, you make your normal F sharp minor type of shape on the second fret, but then instead of barring on the on the third string, second fret, play that A note. So your strings are open, four, four, two, open, open. Call that F sharp sus. So E, F sharp sus. That's your opening part of the song. Do that a couple of times. Then you go to regular F sharp minor, bar chord at the second fret. Then you go to G sharp minor, bar chord at the fourth fret. Do that a couple of times. F sharp minor, G sharp minor. Then you go to A, and then do an A sus 2 by putting your little finger on 2nd uh, string 3rd fret. Back to E major. And then an E sus by putting your little finger on 3rd string 2nd fret. And then for the chorus, another new chord. I call this one a B minor sus. Basically, it's open, open, four, four, open, open. Very easy chord to play. It's like an open B minor, B minor sus. Slide that down the second fret for A sus, four. Then back to E major. Then your B minor sus. A sus four. B minor sus again. Back to E. Okay, you've got all the chords for the whole song now. So if you can just get a fantastic singer like Holly to sing along with you you'll have a real good thing going. Okay, Holly, let's run through the second verse here and I'll help everybody with the chords a little bit. 